you folks, it's the Creepy Kentucky in here with you once again from deadpit.com for another horror movie review. This week, um, or this time, I don't do these weekly, The Witching Season from 2018 is when it came out. It is a horror anthology. Um, independent filmmakers kind of got together and made this horror anthology where each episode in the anthology is set around Halloween night, which, you know, this movie kind of interests me in a couple of different levels. First of all, I'm a big fan of horror anthology movies. You know, the Creepshow series, uh, Tales from the Dark Side movie, uh, Body Bags, Cat's Eye, all those, love all those. So, and I love Halloween as well. Uh, you can see this old school Dead Pit Horror Talk Radio Halloween themed t-shirt logo's kind of down my belly a little bit, but you know, it's all good. But anyway, um, Scream Team releasing came out with this. Um, Michael Bailiff and James Morris brought us this. And when I think of horror anthologies, I kind of, you know, most of the time it is three or four stories set around a there's something in between, you know, connects all of them. This one, really not. Um, it's kind of episodic almost. So it's like a TV show. Um, each episode has its own opening and closing credits. Um, so I'm not sure what the history was with this. I know that the episodes were filmed over the span of a few years. Um, my guess is they were just shorts uh, that the filmmakers were doing. But 2015, uh, Killer on the Loose and Princess, which, you know, the stories in all these are kind of a throwback to a lot of 80s horror themes, 70s, 80s horror themes. Your slasher film, your um, supernatural top movie, um, and Killer Dolls and stuff like that. All that's throughout this these five episodes. Um, one particular episode that really... Um, kind of like it was the to me it was by far the best episode in the movie is they live inside us is the episode and it's almost a horror anthology within a horror anthology which oddly enough i was looking this this up um they are making a feature length version of this episode which it's a story of a writer who's trying to write the the best horror movie he can in a haunted house uh, one night. And he starts with his stories um, and then the, there are little mini movies within that. So, um, but yeah, you've got the names of the, of, of the other ones. You've got Killer on the Loose, Princess, Not Alone, and Is That You? In addition to, Is That You is the one that closed the which I enjoyed that one as well. Um, which all these are, are, are pretty good, you know, for independent films. Uh, a lot of you guys know over the years, Dead Pit Radio, you know, when it comes to independent movies, um, you don't know what you're gonna get. It's almost like Forrest Gump with the box of chocolates, baby. Mm. But um, this one is really good um, atmosphere throughout. The opening credit sequence is amazing, which um, you know it reminded me a whole lot of the opening um, credits in Halloween Four, The Return of Michael Myers. So, um, and they also have a the guys uh, Michael Bailiff and James Morris have you know their own studio, uh, Witching Witching Season Films, aptly named. Um, and they have like videos of Halloween atmosphere, like 25 minute long videos, um, with a lot of the scenery that they have uh, created, um, just basically fall, um, nature in the fall and, you know, some vintage looking Halloween, uh, decorations and stuff like that. It's pretty neat. And then the music, uh, Slasher Dave does an amazing job. I think he does the music in those as well, and he did the music in this episode, or this movie, sorry. Um, the Witching Season, though, Scream Team, uh, did a really good job. You can get it there. 
uh, screen team releasing, or you can go to, um, this is the way I watched it, Amazon Prime right now, they have it up if you're a member, you can check it out. The episodes, um, there are five episodes totaling a little bit over 80 minutes. A um, couple of episodes is like under 10 minutes long. The best one, of course, I mean, in my opinion, was They Live Inside Us, and that one was about 20 minutes. <clears throat> um, enjoyable, man. Actually, like, I, I would recommend this. This would be a great watch on Halloween night. Scream Team Releasing has done other um, Halloween-themed horror anthologies and films and stuff like that, which I'd love to take a look at some of those, hopefully, later on Halloween uh, season. You know, it's coming upon us uh, in September in October, pretty hardcore. So, um, yeah, we'll be checking all that stuff out, hopefully, uh, within the next couple of months. So, but yeah, the witching season, man, I would recommend it. I would actually, uh, um, it's a good recommendation. I wouldn't highly recommend it. Um, it's not perfect. It is independent. They do have a smaller budget, but they do a great job with the budget, the look of the movie, the atmosphere created in the movie. Um, and the episodes are fun. And it is a throwback as well to, you know, classic 80s, 70s and 80s horror movies. You've got your slashers, your creature features, stuff like that. It's all in there. And um, you can't help but, but smile. You know, I know that this movie, I was looking online, it doesn't, um, overall reviews on like IMDb and all that, some people were really ragging on it for some reason. Um, I don't really understand that. My wife watched some of the episodes with me. We enjoyed it uh, for what it was. The um, There's like a mascot in the movie as well. It's like the old haggard witch um, toy is in pretty much every episode. And then if you can, you know, the the artwork, the poster artwork is it's featured on there as well. So fun movie, fun anthology film. Uh, really, I would, I would recommend perfect watch for Halloween night if you've seen Trick or Treat one too many times or Halloween movies one too many times this is break it up a little bit watch this this is the witching season and it is out now Scream Team releasing and Amazon Prime so check it out and check our website out we are over at deadpit.com and check out our horror auction it's coming up actually tomorrow night Friday nights, uh, probably around 8, 30, 9 o'clock. Going to be the B-Plan, the Creepy Kentuckian, and G-Money are all going to be having stuff we're going to auction off, including a dead pit item that we have never sold before online and that is only going to be sold that night. So stay tuned over on the Dead Pit Universe Facebook page or deadpit.com fans. The live stream will be going on there. And um, hope you guys can come out. So I hope you guys enjoyed the review, The Witching Season. Check it out. It's pretty cool. And check us out over at <laughs>